Each object needs to be cleared once upon a time. The washing machine is no exception. After washing a pile of dirty clothes, the inside of the machine can be stained, and the aroma can stick to the walls of the machine and switch to your outfit. Keep reading to learn how to clean your washing machine. Fortunately, you may not need anything beyond that as you have at home. Method 1. Cleaning the washing machine front openings. 1. Fill the machine with hot water. The model of the washing machine is the latest front openings sometimes comes the cleaning cycle. If your washing machine has this feature, fill machine wash it with hot water, then turn on the settings. If your machine does not have an independent cleanup feature, just fill with hot water. 2. Add 1 liter of bleach to remove stains. If the inside of your washing machine bleach stained, can eliminate it. Add through the dispenser so it is mixed with hot water, then let the machine complete the rest of the cycle of washing. 3. Clean the rubber coating on the cover of the machine. This area is particularly vulnerable because the fungus-covered water can be trapped between the layers of rubber and machinery. Use a multi-purpose cleaner and add tissue paper or sponge to clean the bottom and around the rubber layer. 4. Clean the dispenser. Make sure the powder and liquid detergents free of hair and other impurities. Use a multi-purpose cleaner or vinegar and water solution in a sponge to remove any traces of detergent, dirt, and everything that may be a clogged dispenser or washer. Method 2. Cleaning the washing machine top openings. 1. Fill the machine with hot water. The easiest way to do this is to turn on the heat washing cycle and stop it after the water full. You can also heat water in the kitchen and move it into the machine. Two. Add one liter of chlorine bleach. Turn on cycle washing for a couple of seconds to be left so that the function of the agitation can mix the bleach with water. Then turn off the back and let the mixture chlorine idle for at least one hour. This will begin to lift the dirt, mildew, and other materials in your washing machine. If you prefer not to use bleach, you can use a special cleaner machine. These can be purchased in the shop at the household detergent. As the natural alternative, add a liter of white vinegar to replace bleach or cleaners. Complete cycle of washing. After one hour, let the machine complete the washing cycle. At this point, the inside of the machine will turn sanity. If the engine smells like bleach so the cycle is complete, fill with hot water and add one liter of vinegar. Leave it on for an hour, then turn on the washing cycle once again. 4. Clean the dispenser. Use a solution of vinegar and water and polisher for cleaning places where you put powdered or liquid detergent. Dirt, hair, and other crumbs tend to accumulate there. So clearing this area is an important part to keep the inside of the washer clean. Method 3. Keep clean the machine. 1. Take the wet clothes immediately. Leave wet clothes in the machine, even if only for a few hours, can lead to the growth of mildew and mold, which can affect the smell of clothes and the functionality of your machine. Move the wet clothes into the dryer or hangers as soon as the washing cycle is complete. 2. Let the machine open after wash. Close the washer after the cycle is complete may be trapping moisture, creating a perfect environment for mold growth. To prevent this, simply leave the lid open so that the remaining water machine can evaporate. 3. Make sure the machine stays dry. If your machine has a soap or softener drawer wet while washing, remove the process so that the dry cycle the washing is finished. Enter back into the engine only when you are sure that the drawer has been really dry. 4. Do large cleaning once a month. Daily maintenance can help prevent a washing machine too moldy, but you still need to clean up in and about once a month. Use one of the above methods in order to keep your washing machine fresh and can work efficiently for years.